standing here with Justin. This is the guy that actually got a hold of me to do this job over here at the One Stop Shell. You got my name from the paint store then? Well, I got your name first from Brian Buchanan, and then I called the paint store, and I, they gave me the same name as well, so. Nice, yeah. so the word's getting out. Yeah, you're like thunder in this town, man. <laughs> John stopped in to say hey. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, he's one of my biggest supporters there on Facebook. So you're kind of the college crowd. You're a good representation. I yeah, mean. definitely. I mean, look at that. Get up, man. Just <laughs> check out those clothes, that hat. <laughs> so how do you yeah, like the meal so far? Uh, I think it's really cool. It's definitely going to bring people in to check out the beer cave. And, uh, just the artwork. All his artwork has been amazing. So definitely bring people in to check that out. So do you, do you believe in Bigfoot? Oh, totally. He, he totally's out there. He's going to get us one day. I do, too. <laughs> Flagstaff's kind of like that, you know. This is a mountain town, so we get a good laugh out of all these silly things. Definitely. That's how definitely we're really outdoorsy people. Is yes. there going to be an episode of Finding Bigfoot this year? Or, or a season of, of uh, you know that show on Animal Planet? Finding oh. Bigfoot? You ever watch that? <laughs> I've not watched it, but I've heard about it. All right, so we got we got Frankie, Frankie here, and and uh, also Brianna. Are you yeah, making a yeah. face on this? Should I? I don't know. I think you should. <laughs> yeah, that'd be cool. Make your hairy guys. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I will just because you said. <laughs> so I'm here with Amanda. She came by. She always follows me on Facebook. Too. She's a real good supporter. I do. Let's talk about the beer a little bit. How did the beer you? cave? Get the beer cave. Yeah. It's awesome. Nobody does knuckles like you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I try hard. I always love doing hands in art class. Do you, know, my... you think it'll help sell more beer? I think it's going to sell a ton more beer. That's how I think it's going to go down. If this was your gas station, yeah. what would you think on this one? Airplanes. Airplanes, yeah. <laughs> she, she's into aviation. I just learned that she's way into aviation. Yeah. Works out at the airport. Oh. Like so. Brandon is, he is. Now I'm gonna turn this beer cave sign into a glowing red neon sign. So a problem that you always run into with paint is that it's really hard to get brightness, especially with the color red. It's naturally a pretty dark color. The most intense color you can get will always be layering the color over a base layer of white. So you can see I've got the sign painted white up here. So I do that first. So I'm going to bring out my airbrush and then I'm going to do a glow effect around the edges of it in white just like I do my flames. And then I'll do another layer of red because the effect of the white backlighting the red will always be more intense and brighter than if I just did a light color red as in adding white to the red.
Did it turn like out like you expected? Yeah. I didn't even expect something that night. That's nice, dude. Really nice. I like it.